สวัสดีครับ I am currently reading The Righteous Mind by Jonathan Haidt, professor of ethical leadership at New York University, in which he argues that we, the human race, are all essentially self-righteous hypocrites. He quotes from the New Testament of the Bible: "Why do you see the speck in your neighbor's eye, but do not notice the log in your own eye? You hypocrite! First take the log out of your own eye, and then you will see clearly to take the speck out of your neighbor's eye." Enlightenment, or wisdom, if you prefer, requires us all to take the logs out of our own eyes and then escape from our ceaseless, petty, and divisive moralism. As the 8th c e n t u r y Chinese Zen master Sen San wrote, "The perfect way is only difficult for those who pick and choose. Do not like, do not dislike. All will then be clear. Make a hairbreadth difference, and heaven and earth are set apart. If you want the truth to stand clear before you." Never be for or against. The struggle between for and against is the mind's worst disease. Jonathan Haidt is not arguing that we should all live our lives like Sensan, but that if we want to understand ourselves, our divisions, our limits, and our potentials, we need to step back, drop the moralism, the preaching tone, and to stop taking sides, being for and against things, but to accept and embrace what we experience and see clearly what is in front of us. With an open mind, rather than viewing everything through the tinted, potentially distorted glasses of man-made morality, I hope that all at RST learn to see for themselves, to remove societal obstructions and preconceptions, and to accept that everything is not simply binary, and a simplistic for and against approach needs a little more nuancing to be truly effective. I hope you have a lovely weekend. Kopkunkrap.